Hey, what's going on guys? My name's Raf, and today, episode 131 of the Pokemon Journeys anime aired in Japan. This showcased part 3 of Ash vs. Leon in the finals of the Master State Tournament and the Pokemon World Championships. This battle was certainly spicing up, and it blew everyone's mind. We're slowly approaching the end of the climax, but something huge has now just been shown. There's a bunch of information to cover, so let's jump straight into it. Don't forget to leave this video a like to show your support, and I'm sure to bring out my next video shortly. Make sure to subscribe if you haven't already to keep up to date, and without further ado, let's begin. Before we dive into today's episode, let's have a brief chat about next week's preview. I'm telling you all now, Ash is going to beat Leon. From what we've seen of the impact and animation alone, it seems the final clash is in fact going to be a base form between Pikachu and Charizard. It does seem that Eternatus is appearing, and maybe it takes away all of the Dynamax energy, causing Charizard to lose its Gigantamax form. The battle segment is looking super raw and clean, and the motion shown from both sides is truly going to be something you definitely don't want to miss. Now let's dive into my thoughts about part 3 of this battle. Before I begin, the details I'll be discussing are in no particular order. This is just pure speculation. Now this episode was mind blowing. I honestly can't believe how incredible and thrilling it was. Let's start with Rillaboom vs Dragonite. I seriously thought Dragonite was going to cause a double KO by the hope of things, but the end result just proved how strong Rillaboom truly is. This gorilla literally lowered Dragonite's speed and countered the Draco Media, allowing it to win. Even Bulbasaur recognised how strong it was. The same went for Surf Edge. The way it managed to even handle Meteor Assault and counter it was just mind blowing. It's a shame that the duck didn't manage to get the job done, although I am happy to see Dragonfish event Surfage finally taking down Rillaboom. Seeing the XY siblings Bonnie and Clement cameo melted my heart. Now let's talk about Cinderace. The top striker is for sure Leon's most broken Galar starter. Leading the trio, its Libero ability is absolutely broken, and it makes sense why it destroyed Dragonfish despite being awakened. It's going to be interesting to see how it gets defeated in the end against Pikachu. As for the final clash with Gigantamax Charizard, insane animation. I absolutely loved how impactful it was from Leon's side to first bring forward Charizard and explain to Ash how much his partner meant to him. And of course Ash spoke the same vibes with Pikachu. It was heartwarming to see the Alola family return too. Seeing Eternatus break free can only mean one thing next week and I'm sure as we saw in the preview, the final clash will be in the base form. I can't wait to see how this final battle concludes. I'll post my full review on Twitter when subs come out for today's episode. We also now have the confirmed summary for episode 132 which is part 4 of Ash vs Leon the finals part 4, partner. Summary states the following. Eternatus has suddenly appeared in Winden Stadium. What could he be here for? In addition, the battle between Ash and Leon is reaching its climax. As they take on Leon's ace Charizard, Ash and Pikachu mustered the last of their strength. Everything they've gained from all of their encounters, battles and adventures this far. Will Ash be able to seize the laurels or victory alongside his greatest partner? Yes he will. But why not let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. If you guys would like to interact with me, then be sure to follow me on Twitter and join the Team Pokecraft Discord server to discuss all things Pokemon. You can find the rest of my social networks on screen and in the description below. If you enjoyed the video, then be sure to leave it a like as your support is greatly appreciated. Don't forget to share the video with your friends. Finally, make sure to subscribe to keep up to date on my videos and click on the little bell to enable notifications so you guys get notified when I upload a new video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to stick around for more Pokemon content. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.